My name is Nate. I'm from uh, a place called Game Start School. We do some programming classes, Minecraft classes. Um, so I'll be kind of the, given the, the high level directions today, uh, but we've also got a lot of other help in terms of folks who can answer questions and, and kind of help you out. So without further ado, uh, let's see. So you just take flip off the top here, guys. Now, one thing to remember is that as we're taking footage, the camera is right here, right? So if you're gonna if you're gonna fold over the the um, what do you call it the cover, and you do it like this, you won't be able to record anything because it's covering the the camera. So so the ways that I like to do it are to either like kind of fold it. Uh, oh, fold it like this so it's like a triangle you can like hang on to like that you know um, or I think it works to just kind of flip it like this and hold it like this so whatever whatever works um, <clears throat> so to get going uh, does everybody see the camera icon the camera button so that'll be where we start today You guys go to the main screen here and you can get to the main screen just by pressing the the button um, this is the one that we want to do the purple star iMovie right so select that one everybody find it on the right side of the screen where it says um, there's like two options one is outline and one is storyboard you guys see where it's kind of like grayed out storyboard in the upper right if you press that it'll take you to do you mind if I borrow yours real quick so it'll take, you, it'll take you to a screen that looks like this, right? Now every one of these little boxes here on the right is a place where you can put some of your footage, okay? So just to show you real quick how this goes, I might select this one, the action shot, right? So I select this one. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna inject some footage that we took earlier. So I'm gonna click on the recently added down here. And then anywhere in here, I can, I can tap and then see how it kind of captures whatever footage I'm, I'm selecting here, right? So once I find the footage that I want to use, you press this little arrow button here, and then it loads the footage into that little subsection. Can you hear me? What if, if you point it to the side, can you hear me as well? No?